Hello, everybody. This is Suzanne Garfield. I'm going to talk about reading work notes. I'm already in an incident, so I'm going to take a look at the top part of the form to see who the customer is and see what the issue is. Now I'm going to scroll down to the bottom, and the way you read work notes is to go all the way down to the bottom of the work notes. You can see, oh my gosh, this is a really long, detailed ticket. Are you sick yet because I'm scrolling so much? All right, this is too hard to read, so we're going to scroll all the way back up to the activity area. Here we are. Now I'm going to click on the filter button, and look at this. A whole bunch of information is already turned on by default. I'm going to turn it all off. I just want to look at the work notes. What really happened here? Oh, this is great. I can see now what happened and what work was done. But I also want to see what kind of information the customer was sent through the additional comments field. So this is cool. Now I can see the additional comments and work notes. Now back up to the activity area and leave the filters just the way they are. The activities filter is sticky, which means the next time I come to any incident, this is the stuff I'm going to see. If I don't want to see the activity area and get right to the bottom of the ticket right away, lickety split, I can just toggle the activity area off. So that's it for work notes. Happy reading!